Hello everybody, my name is Jemmy, and today I will be starting a new series called Teaching Myself Python in the Future, because I will forget Python in the future, probably. So that's why I'm going to start this series, and in today's video, we're going to be making a name generator in Python. I'm going to be using Jupyter Notebook, but you can use any other uh, Python tools you want. Like, uh, if you want to use Jupyter Notebook, but you don't have it, you can watch one of my old videos that I uh, show how to install it. Uh, it's in the description, so if you want to watch that, then go ahead. So first off, to open Jupyter Notebook, you have to type in CMD in your search bar to open your command prompt, and then just type in Jupyter bitter notebook and then press enter and it will open in your browser like so and then when you get into this page or the home screen you're going to press new python 3 ipy kernel and this will create a new kernel or a python file and you can name this whatever you want i'm going to name this name generator like so make sure there's no weird characters or space because that won't work so once you have your name what you're going to do is you're going to first welcome them a bit, you know, make them know what this program is about. So let's just say welcome to the name generator. You can name, you can, oops, I can't really type like so. Um, And yeah, if we were to try to run that, it would just say welcome to the name generator. You can name it. You can name anything with this program. Uh, So yeah, once we have that, we're going to ask them a few questions. So we're going to ask them first ready to start wait I, I forgot i'm a bit blurring today uh start like so equals to input um ready ready to start a question mark uh, and then we're gonna have a little like uh asterisk i'm not sure what that thing is um just say press any key to or press enter to continue press enter to con to new like so shift enter and uh if they press enter then they go to the next one so we're gonna name this one age we're gonna ask for how old they are uh you uh, let's say how oops i need to put input input how old are you like so and uh we're after that we're gonna go with a color so color equals to input um how what is your favorite color oops what is man i really can't type today what is your favorite color and then they're gonna put that in and then finally we're gonna ask them for their favorite animal so animal equals to input and what is your favorite animal like so and then from then we're gonna combine everything and print into one long name print uh, your the name we suggest is and then we're gonna leave us uh we're gonna leave it at that and then we're gonna put comma comma is to add another like a variable or something else that you want to put in with your message so in this case we're going to put our age in first so whatever they put in and from then we're going to add color color and then we're going to add animal like so and then we to touch it off we're going to add uh, a uh, an exclamation point this i'm using plus uh because I don't want the space the commas give us. So plus, and where's the quotation marks here? Exclamation point. There you go. So let's try it out. Uh, like so. Welcome to the name generator. You can name anything with this program. Ready to start? Press enter to continue. You press enter, and then it starts. How old are you? Uh, I'll put I'm um, 13. What is your favorite color? Let me capitalize this. Okay. What is your favorite color? Uh, let's just say purple. And what is your favorite animal? Capybaras. Like so. The name we suggest is 13 purple capybaras. Well, that's that's a weird name. But you can name it for like, um, I don't know, like a group name. It's 13 purple capybaras. But anyways, thank you for watching this video and see you. Okay.